Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 31st of March 1905, Kaiser Wilhelm II of Germany landed in the Moroccan city of Tangier, where he expressed his support for the Sultan's independence from foreign powers. The Kaiser's speech in Tangier was a direct challenge to the French foreign minister, who had previously secured wide European support for control of Morocco. Despite initial reservations, both Spain and Britain, the latter through the signing of the Entente Cordiale, accepted French control of the country. The Kaiser's speech in Tangier promoted an open-door policy regarding Morocco and sought an international conference to discuss the matter. The French, who believed that their control of the country was now a foregone conclusion, opposed this suggestion, but eventually agreed due to the threat of war. The diplomatic crisis that followed is now referred to as the First Moroccan Crisis. This contributed to the tensions that led to the outbreak of the First World War ten years later. The Algeciras Conference took place between January and April 1906 and was a diplomatic disaster for Germany. Of the 13 nations present, only Austria-Hungary supported Germany's position. Even Italy, who was a member of the Triple Alliance alongside Germany, sided with the French. Although an agreement was eventually reached, Kaiser Wilhelm emerged bitterly humiliated. His attempt to drive a wedge between France and Britain had failed and had resulted in turning the Entente Cordiale into a loose military alliance. The second Moroccan crisis in 1911 subsequently created further tensions between Europe's power blocs. 